Kyiv begins offensive actions on the front lines of the Ukraine war while Zelensky mocks hysterical Russia. Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky says Moscow has reacted hysterically to every step we take in Donetsk. The enemy knows that Ukraine will win, he added. However, Kyiv has refuted Russian accusations that it has launched a significant counteroffensive. Ukrainian forces are shifting to offensive actions in several regions along the front line. In the south of Ukraine's Donetsk area, Moscow claimed to have stopped a significant Ukrainian offensive, killing 250 troops and destroying 16 tanks. Hannah Malir, the deputy defense minister of Ukraine, rejected the allegations and said that they had been contrived to deflect attention from Russian defeat in Bakhmut. She denied claims that Ukrainian soldiers were taking part in a massive operation, saying instead that they were shifting to offensive actions in specific regions along the front line. Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky claimed Moscow has responded hysterically to every step we take in Donetsk in a speech hours after visiting the UK Foreign Secretary in Kyiv. He said, first of all, I am grateful to each of our warriors, to all our defenders who gave us the news we expect. Bakhmut direction, well done, warriors. Mr. Zelensky added, the enemy knows that Ukraine will win. They see it. Even though Russia unlawfully occupied Donetsk last year, Moscow only has limited authority over the city. According to Moscow's leaked drone footage, Ukrainian equipment was destroyed. Two weeks after the Wagner organization led the victorious attack on the eastern city following the bloodiest combat of the conflict, the organization claimed that Ukrainian troops have retaken a portion of a village north of Bakhmut. Yevgeny Prigozhin described it as a disgrace and said that Berkivka had been retaken by Kyiv forces. Sergei Shaigu, Russia's defense minister, and Valery Gerasimov, its chief of staff, were among the military figures he pleaded with to join the front lines. On his second trip to Kyiv, UK Foreign Secretary James cleverly met with Mr. Zelensky and the nation's foreign minister, Dmitry Kuliba, earlier on Monday. According to the Foreign, Commonwealth, and Development Office, the two talked about how the UK can continue to help Ukraine in the best possible ways, including through military aid and financial assurances. The visit coincides with preparations for the Recovery Conference for Ukraine, which will take place in London later in June and focus on improving the country's economy.